you. Easy, easy. I, I just shaved this morning. Oh, really? You missed a spot. All right, all right. Just calm down. Give me a chance to apologize. For what? That, for example. You sneaky son uh, of a... Ah, uh, watch it. You're in a church. Are you always this charming, or am I just lucky? Ha <laughs> <laughs> Candlelight. <laughs> Privacy. Music. I can't think of a finer place for hand-to-hand -hand combat. You fight almost as well as a man. Funny, I was gonna say the same thing about you. Ooh, that's hitting a little below the belt, don't you think? No, this is. <laughs> Touche. Didn't know you had a kid. Well, he doesn't take kindly to soldiers. I noticed. Uh, permit me? The name's Phoebus. It means sun god. And you are? Is this an interrogation? I believe it's called an introduction. You're not arresting me? Not as long as you're in here. I can't. Huh. You're not at all like the other soldiers. Well, thank you. So, if you're not going to arrest me, what do you want? I'd settle for your name. Esmeralda. Beautiful. Much better than Phoebus. Good work, Captain. Now arrest her. <laughs> Claim sanctuary. Say it. You tricked me. I'm waiting, Captain. I'm sorry, sir. She claims sanctuary. There's nothing I can do. Then drag her outside and... Frollo, you will not touch her. Don't worry. Minister Frollo learned long ago to respect the sanctity of the church. Witted me, but I am a patient man, and gypsies don't do well inside stone walls. What are you doing? I was just imagining a rope around your beautiful neck. I know what you were imagining. Such a clever witch. So typical of your kind to twist the truth and cloud the mind of unholy thoughts. Well, no matter. You've chosen a magnificent prison, but it is a prison nonetheless. Step one foot outside, and you're mine.